So we have our character ready and let's say we want to import it out in Photoshop now. But for that, you have to first save it to your Creative Cloud libraries. That is, you have to save it in your CC library right here. And to do that on the top right hand corner, you see an option save to CC libraries right over here. So if I were to click on this, what happens is that you, you have an option to give a character name right here. So once it connects to your server, your library will show up right here. So the library that we are going to choose is your library. So I'm just going to uh, make a new library called TutorTube right over here. And then I'm going to give a character name. So I'm just going to say uh, like, to the tube fuse character just like this so once i'm happy with this what i can simply do is click on save and it'll generate the file as obj as you can see on the bottom right here it'll process it out and upload it to our creative cloud library so this will take a bit of time so i'm just going to fast forward the process right here you can see that it is uploading it's about 21 megabytes in size and then it says your character is being synced to your Creative Cloud library and this will take about a minute or two. Access your character from the libraries panel in Photoshop CC. So now it says that the character is ready and we can access it from our Photoshop CC. So I'm just going to press done and the character has been uploaded. And once uploaded, what happens is that you can go on to your Creative Cloud desktop and here you'll get a notification right over here. So here you can see that it says the fuse character, uh, TutorTube fuse character is now in your library, TutorTube it says right here. So you'll get this notification and you, you can access it by going onto your work right here. And then you can see that I got your library and TutorTube library and got the model right over here, just like this. You can also view it on your uh, web, li uh, on the web of your library as well. So just like this, you can go on to assets.adobe.com slash files or assets.adobe.com, go on to your libraries and then on your own file, you can see that you got TutorTube and your library right here. So you can just go over here and view it out. So you can see right here that you got the character just like this. And this is how you'll be able to view your assets. So there you go. There's our fuse character that we made in th that we made and it has been successfully uploaded in the Creative Cloud Library. So now we'll be able to import that out in Photoshop. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.